I am Marcia Gordon. I'm a pediatric dentist in Allentown, Pennsylvania. The building that we put up was about 10 years ago, and it really was just a group effort. I think all of my staff, we sat down to come up with a way that we could make it comfortable for parents and children of all ages. They didn't want a place that people would outgrow. Um, I think we needed to express the child in all of us. If you notice all the artwork in the building or children's artwork, that's my enjoyment in a day to tell all the stories of the little kids and, and you know how they keep us going. Your job is to help calm them and relax them and, and really help the parent as well. But it also gives us the greatest source of laughter all day long. I grew up in Virginia and it was a little bit uh, lopsided as far as how many females were around. There were about 10 females in my class. It was the first time they had females in the, um, in the school. When I first got into dental school, um, I went, I was very excited. I went with my mother and we we're gonna, you know, buy something to, uh, to highlight the momentous time. And the woman at the jewelry store said, you're taking the place of a very good man. How dare you? Hey, it was changing times just as it is now. And when times change, people don't always know. I didn't always take offense at those things. I knew that they were, and you have to learn to pave your own way. You know, I really wanted to be a dentist. I didn't want to be a female dentist. I didn't, I thought that was really ridiculous. I wanted to be and, and be counted as one and the same. And if you start to listen to the voices you want to hear, you have naysayers all along the way, no matter who you are, what you do. And I think it really forces you to listen to yourself and to develop that side. And the naysayers can be wonderful motivators. Um, you've got to turn it around and make sure you're hearing the right voices and, and the ones that promote you to things that you want to do. And it doesn't happen overnight. I think the Lucy Hobbs project is important. We all need to mentor each other. We all become part of a community that way and we all have to learn every day. So it, those are the innovations and where it takes us is really what's important to move forward. I love my practice. I love my dental family. I am Dr. Marsha and I am Lucy Hobbs.